report that emanated from the acting communications director of the Convention's People's Party, Sylvester Saponsuprano indicated that the CPP will not be fielding any presidential candidate for the upcoming elections, ascribing reasons to delay in the party's internal processes to go to Congress to elect national executives five months to the polls. But addressing journalists in Accra about the developments, the party vehemently debunked the earlier report, indicating that the CPP is better placed to partake in the general elections. I want to state on record that the Convention People's Party shall elect a flag bearer ahead of the 2024 elections. All media stations are therefore entreated to disregard any unsanctioned misinformation that the CPP will not file a flag bearer. It is never so. It will never happen in the history of the Fourth Republic where the founding party of Ghana will not contest in an election. It won't happen. And we, the organizational committee, our task is very simple to ensure that come December, the red cockerel is in on, the, on the ballot. Ahead of the polls, an eight-member independent committee has been constituted as the highest national decision-making body in the party to oversee the streamlining of all internal processes leading to the Congress to elect a flag bearer to lead the party into the December 7 elections. A sub-national reorganization committee is also in place to augment the work of the independent committee by auditing the national delegates album and recalibrate it as the official document for the Congress. The committees have also zoned the country into three for grassroots engagement. The coordinator of the National Reorganization Committee, Moses Jirimambo Ambin, said the delay in the party going for Congress is driven by research. We are doing what we call proper reorganization of the party concurrently. So it is not an exercise of where people are saying that we are just sitting to do album. No, a lot of studies have been done over the weeks and this is a continuation of the exercise and we are moving straight into the various constituency to ensure that the CPP is up and doing in all 276 constituency proud to election 2024. The independent committee of the CPP is also seeking to reunite with all members who have exited the party or relinquished their positions, resorted from internal wranglings. Stanley Nibler, TV3 News, Asylum Down.